Good afternoon, everyone. I'm 3 News Now, Chief Meteorologist Mark Stitz. This morning, we were dodging some spotty rain, which kept things pretty cloudy. And some of that spotty rain does continue early this afternoon, but all of it should be out of here by mid-afternoon. And just like this morning, a lot of us will keep it dry in the first half of the afternoon. Behind the clouds, a lot more sunshine and temperatures like yesterday in the mid and upper 80s, above average for this time of year. Also, a little bit breezy and muggy at times, too. We'll keep it mostly clear tonight, then for the partial lunar eclipse, so a great view of that. And as that peaks around 945, our temperatures will be in the upper 70s, so very comfortable to get out and look at that. Then overnight, more clouds start to move in, and by 3, 4 o'clock in the morning, some showers and thunderstorms well to the west of the Omaha metro. Now, those will push farther east as we go into the Wednesday morning commute, but notice quite a few of them won't make it to the Missouri River and to Omaha. So just some spotty hit and miss rain during the Wednesday morning commute. And the difference tomorrow, really any time of day, may have to dodge an isolated shower or storm, but the later into the afternoon we go, the drier things will get across the region and the more sunshine we'll see and temperatures very similar to what we've seen the last couple of afternoons. So even though a few more of us will see rain, especially in eastern Nebraska, west of Omaha Wednesday, a lot of us will still be keeping it dry. So today 87 and breezy tomorrow, 86 and breezy and then Thursday gets a little extra hot and a little extra humid highs near 91 with only a very small chance of rain. Then Friday we pull back the heat a little bit into the upper 80s. Most of the day dry with some sunshine, but as we go into Friday evening and night, the return of some hit and miss rain. But after a lot of small chances of rain during the work week, rain does finally become a little bit more widespread across the region Saturday morning, so a lot more of us will see it. We'll get a little bit drier in the second half of the day, but cooler near 79. Still some showers and storms across the area on Sunday for the start of fall with low 70s, and we'll keep it comfy for the first full day of fall on Monday.